Amen. We thank God to thank you, Jesus. everyone. Amen. God bless you, sir. Amen. God is good. God is good. We give God thanks. Amen. I wonder why the song said, Ride on, King Jesus. No man can do Go before us, Lord. You know that I work by myself. Amen. God has been so good to us. We give God thanks for the, you know, the opportunity, you know, to be here. Um, the news don't show, meaning midday news or prime time news don't show in a Jamaica in a year, so two day, three day. It reach at different heights. And a one no more, two, double murder, triple murder, too much murder, six day, you know, all type of stuff. So when you leave short a week, my God, it's a, it's a milestone to be able to see each other again and we give God thanks for that privilege. So we are going into a Sunday school um, in Matthew chapter 6. We're going to pick up from verse, um, verse 5. When I saw this thing and I taught it, Important. Um, Matthew chapter 6, from verse 5 to verse 8. Amen. I read it. You just follow Matthew chapter 6, from verse 5 to verse 8. It said, And when thou prayest, thou shalt not be as the hypocrites are, for they love to pray standing in the synagogue and in the corner of the street that they may be seen of men. Verily I say unto you, they have their reward. But thou, when thou prayest, enter into thy closet, and when thou shut thy door, pray to thy father who is in secret, and thy father who sit in secret shall reward thee openly. Verse 8. But when he prayed, Use not seven, seven. seven. But when he pray, use not vain repetition as the Eden do. For they think that they may they shall be heard for their much speaking. Verse 8 and last. He said, Be not ye therefore like unto them, for your father knoweth what things he have need of before pray. Amen. That, Amen. that would let it sound like prayer is not necessary. But let us see. So notice um, Jesus begins to talk about prayer. And the first thing he, he begins to address in prayer is attitude. Amen. Amen. Because I want you to, to understand that our words are secondary when it comes to prayer. The attitude that you approach God with determines what you leave with. And they said something in the world. They say your attitude determines your altitude, meaning the heights that you go. That's why um, in the olden days, one thing um, I often hear from my mother and older um, folks, they said, man has bring you to the world. And I was wondering, oh man is not bring you to the world, and man is not money. Amen. But then I realized that they were saying, when you have respect for people, they will look out for you, you know. Amen. Because there are some places, even when you have your money, you can't enter night. But the, I see people with money and stand outside, but somebody with, with, with persons know they just go right up and just go around at the other side. They want to about that. I mean, they want to say, love. Some sort of respect, manners. Um, when, when the, the right attitude gets you to places where education can't get you. Um, the right attitude can get you to places and allow people to see you. That you are normally overlook you when you have the, the right attitude. And that's the reason why one of the things is key as um, a person, not just a believer, but as a person, we cannot allow people to bring us to where they want us. Amen. Meaning, we, we, we don't have to answer everyone. Choose up. That 
Dubai. You know, it's like I was coming and I was coming out and um with the, with coming out at the pharmacy and, and, and the taxi are coming, you know, taxi man, they, they, each other intimidated. But when I intimidated by a taxi man, I was so I'm still a child, so I'm stop. You know, so because so, because so put a man and go so. The man, the man put out, he, he, he went, why do you mean I put it in air? And say, if I eat, must say, what's ever with my wife? You know, I don't, I don't respond to it. You see, so sometimes, you know, often answer people according to what they say. And when you don't answer them according to how they act, sometimes they're embarrassed because they assure them say you're bigger than them. But don't pass that oh, level to yeah. answer your will. Because let me tell you something. All of us as individuals stand on a platform. There are people where they don't deal. If if them if you if you answer them, you automatically go over the level. You, you, choose you see that? So if if them curse, and you you curse, automatically degrade yourself because you don't know who is watching. I watch you. You can miss an opportunity because that person. Because many times when people want to do something good for you, I'm talking about genuine people. They don't tell you. They watch many times and they say, oh, yeah. pastor always come and pastor shoes leave and buy a pastor one shoe. You understand? People, yeah, people watch and see what you want and then they come and buy it. So you can miss an opportunity when they hear you say something and see you do something. So that they, you can't allow people. That's why in Proverbs he said, answer not a fool according to his father. Meaning don't, don't he said, let's be home like him. You see that? So by speaking in a manner as old they speak, you only assure somebody that you're just like them. Amen. I thought you were different, but when you open your mouth, you say you're the same thing. So the end of the day, one thing with situation, situation don't change people. Situation reveal people. Here it is. Hey, everyone. Situation don't change people. It reveal people. Oh, oh, me more. Situation don't change people, it reveal people. I, I I watch people. I watch people um in different stages of life. <laughs> Meaning there are people in a job because they elevate, but they must change. Meaning they must stop talk to the person that they used to be friendly. I see people go overseas and they overseas for years and they become citizens. But they still come down every year and they still remember their family who said things to them. Yes, sir. So it means that what situation does, it don't change you, it reveals you who you are. Because if, if you will change with situation, meaning you're not a person who can be trusted. Don't, I tell you, don't be like water. You see that? No, sir. Because if you put water in the fridge, it will ice. Yes. If you chew a cool air in it will drink. Yes, sir. If you put it in the pot, that boy will turn vapor. So water becomes anything we want it to be. I can become anything we want it to be. You can chew it in a paint and mix it and it will be. So you, 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 you can't be that unstable. That's why um, Jacob said to Reuben, he said you're unstable as water. You know what I said? Is that? So if you, if you be like water, it's not a good thing. If you change with everybody, it's not a good thing. Amen. I better people eat of who you are. Oh, sir. Come on. Then to become like what they want to be. Hallelujah. Is that? Because truly anybody who wants to change if you be like them, don't like you. Not true. You don't believe you. Come on. You're not here. Meaning, look, notice now. Notice. Being somebody else that not possible, the best person you can be is yourself. Yes, so if somebody that try to change your to be like them, they're not like them. That no matter tell you, there's something more you're gonna like as a boy to change. Be like me. You're not like me. Oh, yes. We can understand if it is a certain attitude that needs to be changed yes, sir. according to scripture, not according to people's perspective. Because notice, there are people that want me to change according to freedom perspective, not Bible. 
When I would cheer to for your person, I would cheer for Bible. Amen. I would cheer for God, but the cheer should become something where you want me to become. We're not we're, we're, we're not going to do the Bible. We're not going to So the first thing where Jesus addressed when it comes to pride is attitude. Because if your if your attitude is not right, even when you say the right words, it now it is still not given a result. You see that? So you you have to you have to you have to understand that the problem that many persons have. But then say, "Can people come as a pastor? Me pray, me pray, me pray to. But why is it that you pray and you're having a problem?" You pray and you have a problem because of your attitude. Are you listening to me? Yes, yes. I, 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 I was, this is out of my, um, because remember we read 10 chapters a day, 4 days. Yes, sir. So this, this thing I, I was reading and it didn't come to me out of me and I said, ah, the Lord, I will share this thing because it's real. Because it, 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 if you hear people say we pray, I don't know how. So now we choose up. Because the Bible said the ear the, the ears of God is open over the prayer of the righteous. Amen. Yes. So if, if you if you and me declares the righteous, why would you not hear? Hallelujah. You see that? So the, the key factor here, the Bible said in, in ears is open to the prayer of the righteous. The key word here is righteous. righteous. The attitude, the person. When we embody the personality. You see that? So, so God answers personality more than person. Yes, sir. You finally go. You see that? God answers personality more than person. Because the Bible says God is not a respecter of person. Amen. That's why many person pray what you answer, answer personality. Meaning the, the particular attitude of the person. That him alone for the answer. Yes. You see, see you, you, have, you have to understand say, the first thing you have to address when it comes to prayer and your attitude. How you approach God. Because if, if you approach God like you approach a friend, you're wrong. If you approach God like how oh, like, oh, some people approach your mother, if you approach and reverence their mother, respect your mother, yes, you respect sir. their father. If you approach God that way, it's good. But if you approach God, like going up on the street and say the genocide, you're wrong. If you approach God and say no say party, you're wrong. You see that? If you approach God like going up say Miguel, you're wrong. You see that? So many times what will happen to us is the, the, the attitude. What we use in the world, meaning I'm putting that different way. The slang with them and the style and the attitude of them use them to talk to a virgin. I'm assuming I'm going to talk to God. And you're wrong. The attitude they use, like they they lock the fact in and sit on top with your friend. I say you're going to approach God. You're wrong. So the, the first thing God address are the attitude. Notice what he said. He said, When thou prayest, thou shalt not be as the hypocrites are. You see that? The attitude. Because hypocrite is not a person. Hypocrite is a, is, is a, is a, is, is, is also like a personality in a person. Amen. And hypocrite, you, you can embody. Young people, they, they can embody bad mind. Meaning you look and then you see them bad mind. So, Young people can embody. And we call it now. What did they do? What did they call it? People are sitting on and gossip. Gossip. But yeah, people can embody gossip. When they look at them, they say, ah, I dare not trust the sweetest friend. See, you have to understand some people, you can embody certain personality that when you go before God, you are get rejected before the more open. Amen. Because prior I not answer because He's a pastor and because he like this. No, prayer is answered because of the personality. Who 
Uyi ye ye understand who ya approach. We Matthew chapter 6 and verse 5. So you understand the Bible says, don't be as the hypocrites are. Because the hypocrite have a particular personality when God reject them before. Amen. They reach. Meaning all of them, the, the, the prayer with them are pray. Them, them, them just are pray. It's just words. You know what I'm saying? So notice now. Look at one of the look at look at one of the um look at a few characters what Jesus pointed out with the hypocrites. And it, it, it is um it's very startling if you know that it is already. Notice what he said. He said, For they love to pray. You see that? I think I think you have to pray, but not supposed to have a love to pray, right, mother? But Jesus is the one thing with the hypocrite that they love to pray. True. But notice, notice what notice the problem. He said, For they love to pray. Standing in the synagogue in the corner of the street. Why? To be seen. That's why the money book. Amen. Not just look at them love to pray, but feel them loving to pray. Is that they everybody say, ah, but I tell them, Paul can pray, see man. No, it's that one. That's a ministry. Understand? That's a ministry. Remember, remember, I'm still going to know. Um, so the school, so we can ask questions. So that is a ministry. Understand? So the end of the day, what Jesus is talking about, he's talking about people. What what does? There was some people by the street, and then they say, "Shut up!" They want to. What do you want to do that for? And I talk about the one on my different people. Remember, you have um, you have evangelists. Evangelists are truly made for the street, not church. You get to know, so that's why the Bible is a field of evangelism. Go down to Samaria and preach Christ. So if you left from Jerusalem, go down to Samaria. So you have people that really give to go out on the street. They give a word and evangelize. But you have some people that you know them not evangelize. You know them not. You don't say, Chant down, run out, Chant down. It's our fall upon them. Those people matter at all. Those young people say they can go to them and pray. Why? What do they pray for? So, so Jesus is saying, yeah, these people, they put us to run at the We used to work at one place. And we used to work at the factory. We were like the post to work at the factory. There was some a lady down there. And there was some lady down there. We used to when them begin to start to say them and pray. And say, God, come. You know, one of the heavens now open. Okay. <laughs> Two and then go on. And those of us said, those are those are people. Yeah, but after uh, the them disturb work. Nonsense of no come because as they done, nobody no care malice like them. Nobody no hypocrite like them. Nobody no see it like them. So you do it matter we have people with disturb the few things, you know, purpose. Amen. They must have me at work. I work everywhere. I, I have never said the spirit of Japan is a minister. I have never been driving in a bus and the Holy Ghost of Japan and start speaking. I never. If, if, it, if it's light, you may speak and I'm regret or something, but nothing. This big old burst. If it disrupt everything, we draw attention to you. That's what I'm talking about. These people are a seek attention. You understand, there are people where, where they must seek attention, but they must do it in, in, in my own spirituality. They do it just as well, put it in another way. There are some people that want to preach, right? So they go to Bible school, they have some qualified diploma and certificate. So when I hear them call up, they mean, this is Pastor Brown. He, he graduated from the university, he has seven degrees. You must be a term of the doctorate. You must six hundred, you know? So when they when they hear the yeah. report the men, they say, ah, it must be. I said, more people, more people, more. I get <laughs> when I look at body as no. They now have not look rubbish. But they come to you to reach. So so you see that so they they they, they, they what Jesus addressed in the scripture before he tell us about all for prayer is the attitude. Because why, as we said, 
We tell people every day, me no nobody. Me no no special. No, no, in a way, no way. Where, where, make me special more than nobody else. You get the message? Me do wrong like you. But my child is supposed to write after the no one who may have got to. Make a difference. Notice, there's one thing with people where we know how um, to go to a certain place. If we are going to a court, we know the dress. Because we know we can have a court in a, in a, in a, in a jansen you know, so? and, and sharp pants. We have to look like it. Even like this, not so bad. But when, you are, when we are approached, you have to talk into it. You see that? You need to know. But when we are approached that, we are approached that like, oh, Cain approached that. The Bible says, Cain just bring some food and he go kind of straight to that. He can't wait until he won that. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, Cain. But the Bible says, he will brought a very first in some way and accept it to God. So the main thing why people not get their prayer answer are the attitude by which we approach God. Not word, we can notice now. You may say, Pastor, don't prepare a liar and tell the Me not going to prepare. Me not going to prepare. I will prove it to you. You find Romans chapter 8. I'm sure that at Sunday school, I'm sure that we don't know how to pray. No, no, we don't know how to pray. Any man said, I don't know how to pray. Empty my liar. We don't know. We don't know how to pray. Romans chapter 8, I think a verse, verse 27, 26. If you don't hear me, you're not going to respond. 
I see him thinking of prayer. If you pray and God no respond, he will not hear you. Something a black him from responding to you. Because it is God, God has to be the pleasure, the pleasure of God is to answer prayer. The purpose of God is to answer prayer. Amen. The notice now, verse 6. He said, notice now, it changed. The, 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 the thing now. Notice him still a tell him a tell her attitude now. It's about thou when thou prayest, enter into thy closet. Meaning the attitude now must be an attitude. An attitude of, of reverence. Meaning secret. Because look it. You see, um, prayer is something for people come around with my voice. Like, that's what they tell people. This is not a prayer word. You know I'm doing a prayer word. Prayer word is not a calling. You know what I'm saying, Sister Harrison? Prayer word is not a calling. Everybody, you know, the Bible said in Luke chapter 18, verse 1, it said, man, the word man is human. H-U-M-A-N. Human must always pray. Human beings then. So, so no, 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 prayer is not a prayer word here. Not true worship. Eh, eh, eh. Who are we? To be true worshiper according to John chapter 4. That the Father seeks true worshiper. The Father seeks people pray. So how you become prayer warrior? And if you feel ill, the prayer warrior come. Prayer warrior, that you know, she left on the prayer bar. The world of it left on the prayer bar. And the world of it supposed to pray. And we left on the prayer bar. So at the end of the day, there is no such thing as prayer warrior. And we challenge any prayer warrior. We don't matter what it is, we, we, we challenge them any prayer warrior and we challenge any true worshiper and we're not going to divide. One scripture, we don't want to give them one scripture. Thank God. Because there's no, those things allow other people to feel inferior in the house of God and the things of God. Amen. So every time, there's a one and forty prayer warrior. You feel like you're praying a war, not me. Yes, what are we praying in a war? Notice what he said. He said, But thou, you might talk to me and you. He said, But thou, when thou prayest, enter into thy closet. It don't mean to buy one closet and go in it. It don't mean to build one closet in your house and go in to go pray. No. What a closet is. No, none of you know, know what is in my closet. The closet, any closed that closet, that me alone. Anything that makes a, a closet is a secret place, a closed place, a solitary place. So what Jesus is saying, he said, approach a place and pray there with the right attitude. You don't have to go and tell everybody. Somebody said, pray on the bed front, pray on the bed side. That's why they leave and then know. Which God will find me. And then God will work with God. Them say she's praying at that bed at 8 o'clock. Slap her now. Notice. So the attitude, he said, And when thou shut thy door, pray to thy father, which is in secret. And thy father will see it in secret, shall know how they open. So, secret prayer, our prayer with the right attitude come with reward. Prayers with the right attitude come with Pray to your father, your father. It's in seeking. I notice now. One of the things you have to also bear in mind, the word is a pray to thy father. Meaning you have to know who you are put. You, you, have to, you have to have confidence in your relationship with God. Right. You have to have confidence in God here. Confidence. So otherwise some attitude being one a key factor in a prayer, confidence in the next one. Because you can have the right attitude where you lack confidence, you're defeated. That's why you say without self-confidence, you're twice defeated in the race of life. Meaning you're defeated first in your mind, and when you start wrong, that's the next one. So at the end of the day, the right attitude and confidence must be possessed in a prayer. Are you hearing me? Are you getting very learning in show, man? I want you to understand him. the more you can pray, the easier it will be when you come to church. I understand him. 
the more you can pray, meaning the more confidence you have in a prayer, your prayer, when the prayer goes, and when you come in for prayer, it's better. Amen. The more easier. So notice now. Before they know, this is and thy father will see it in see which are reward the open. So private prayer gives public reward. Secret prayer gives public power. Because if only you may have come and pray so, you don't know. So power in a public shows you a relationship there, there in a private. Amen. Let me put it a different way everybody can understand. My normal live by the house. You never see them and do not yet. Right? But there's no man coming to that belly. You confident now that so something is going on. You see that? I, I saw prayer still. You, you don't have to tell nobody you are praying. You come out and you can sit so you are praying. Amen. Amen. I put it a different way. Moses spent 40 days in the mountain with God. The Bible says when he comes and he feels that shine, he never will tell nobody that he will tell with God. You see that? So at the end of the day, you know, you know, we see the man and the woman, but you come out and I barely look so. We know what the something that. We don't, we don't know too much time, but we know exactly. God, you can't, you can't see those results below nothing. Meaning, when it comes to prayer, you can't see results if you're not produce some in a secret. So, secret prayer, I'll give a public result. And then, notice now, the results now will not only be say the person can pray. You're going to find your life changed. You're going to find your start with better shoes too. Oh, you cannot believe it. You think you let him pray because we're spiritual sitting alone. I ever pray every day I'm hungry like that. Oh sorry. Me pray every day I'm hungry like that. No. When you are praying, things in your life, man, I go change. It may impact your spiritual life first. Because prayer I will affect your body. Your spirit. But after a while, you will see things change. You stop by you stop by bad juice. And start by buffalo juice. Your friends say you stop drinking soda and start by natural juice. You understand? Because you only have pray things that will happen. Because you see, little. Everything where God do is to prepare man. That's why when God called Abraham, he never gave Isaac the same time. Because Isaac and Sarah never prepared for I Abraham and Sarah never prepared for Isaac. That's why when they just come to church, don't watch nobody with their long time and things are Amen. You don't prepare it. I can't give you my story if you give it here already. You have a blue shirt and you wear it so long. You have to till you wash, you can see. See, I have a different, different fabric and them sew together. Because they die with them dikes, so I wash out. And the brown shirt look awful. And they have a black pants and use peroxide and dikes and look kind of brownish. No, no, we can wear shirt. I long sleeve shirt. If you have a moon, you don't see the same one. But the sofa, you see that? So you, you can't, you, no aspect of people life in a church, you can't walk. And you don't know the relationship and where they come from. So when you see them uh, 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 exercise spiritual authority, give God thanks to them. When you see them coming and wear nice clothes, give God thanks to them. You don't know. I saw me tell you, I'm very bad man. But those men are right, I'll let them come and see me and show me. Amen. Just let some happen to them. Because at the end of the day, it's a shame to look at a man like me and bad man. We're hungry, so long. But a man is a nightclub. 
at 10 o'clock we just had one, one meal for the whole day. You get what I'm So people don't know where you have to go and a secret to produce the results where you have. Amen. And I got Jesus a talk about in a prayer also. You have to have something that go on in a secret to things that are publicly. Notice already now, verse 7. Remember, you see, you can ask questions. If you have questions, you ask questions. Verse 7 said, He said, But when he prayed, use not vain repetitions. As he did, let me give you the vain repetition. He said, Don't use vain repetition. Meaning, the word vain there is foolishness. Meaning, don't go to God and repeat foolishness. It don't mean you can't go to him and remind him every day say any healing. It don't mean that. It don't mean you can't go to him and remind him that ah, we call him in that situation. No. If the word via there means foolishness. You don't know people come before God and talk foolishness. So, and I mean says that Jesus. If you if you saw no way, but that don't mean say that Jesus it said you don't don't go talk fool, don't repeat foolishness every day to me. Somebody will call it, I don't want to tell you. I tell you, Robbie, she told you, I tell you, she told 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 it signifies like just as how you when, when you have uh, the bear worship by a moon car, they were called the Philistine. Those are those are heathen, meaning those people right off the block. They're not good to do with God. Go, don't go around and go say Jesus. Don't go around, no, they're going to have problems. Those are heathen. They're going to look for them publicly confess. So they're not going to do with Jesus. So it said, don't you don't use foolish repetition as a heathen do. Notice now. Look at the next part. It's a for they think that they shall be heard for they want much speaking. You have to understand. You have to understand this. It's a for they think that they should be heard. So the reason why they, they, they carry on like this, the things are gonna hear. See so how some people they go. Let me tell you something. There are some people we hear and some people are tolerant. Meaning, we hear, we listen to some people. We have some people that talk to we just tolerate them. They can't, in our mind, they can't do it. It's true. Yeah, so true. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. So true. You know, they never have to but it's not to me a lot. Then, you know, I'm like, we'll talk to people for now. Sometimes I'm like, I can't do it. You don't mind. So, 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 so you, you, don't, you don't want you to set up their prayer. And the Holy Ghost, like, I can't do it. So the Bible, I, I, I show you, said, no, you will be able to look at it, team that they shall be heard from what speaking. Not because, let me tell you, I put that in here. Not because you talk holy for things. You need to be here with yourself. Not because you talk low, you need to be here. The way some people talk low, they talk, ah, ah. They didn't hear me, no, you know what I'm saying? Like, all they need to call you, they must have heard that. So notice the Bible says four day things. So what what we're wrong in at them? We make God hear them and then talk. You see that matter? Why God not hear them because of what them think? This is what we think. We put always approach God. This is what we think and work when we say that we that's not work. Because prior also you have to submit to teaching. That's why he said in Luke 11 verse 1, he said, Lord, teach us to pray. So when you go to pray, nobody can think if you said this. 
You know? That's why the song, the song said, um, it's a song, said, I swear now. Right? But in a song we love, it said, just as I am. You know, one plea. But that thy blood will shed for me. So me now go to God and tell him, say, because I'm fast in the hear me. Me not have not to plea, but me not have, not have no more you can tell him to make him answer me. You see that? Me, me not have no, you may have somebody that's up God with the fast and with the but me not have no. Me not have nothing behind me because I said, God with the fast and no. Me not have nothing to plea. Me, just like you, you're going to court. You are the, you know, you know what you are the mercy at the life Amen. and the judge because some court cases where you can't get out, they don't want to find you. And the, 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 the judge and the lawyer and the jury have decided to fit, they don't stay that way. I saw when we go before God, I saw me go away. Me not have to be. Me not have righteousness. So you have, you have to understand when, when you approach God, you approach many times. We have things sometimes end up. Notice, let me give you this. In 2 Kings chapter 5 with Naaman, don't turn it, but let's give you a story. If you want to write it, you can write it up here. 2 Kings chapter 5. When Naaman, uh, Naaman, Naaman went to Elijah the prophet, Elijah the prophet sent out a servant and said, We'll be in a jar. Now we'll send them in a jar. The Bible said the man wrapped. Notice that he said, I think. That he will have come out and call upon him God and strike him over the spot. Amen. And he will go back in a rage. Mm-hmm. But when I serve and say to him, say, my father, if the prophet did tell us we don't want great, we don't do it. But the simple thing is to go wash. And be clean. So sometimes why we pray is not answer and a big thing we have is a simple thing. Our things are things simple, attitudes, no. He could have missed in cleansing because he said me think he might not come out and do all type of theatrics. But the man said, go out here. He feeling so. So you have to understand our mind every time we go to God. It shut down the Holy Ghost. I feel like God. I the breaker. I'm coming on the breaker. Light in the in the, in the, in the panel but it can't come in the house. Because God never run out of life, God never run out of answer, God never run out of power. But the panic, I break up over your life, just boom, and lock up, because you run out of So he said, use not what? Vain repetition. Don't, don't repeat. Don't repeat foolishness before God. That in Eden, because they think they will be heard for the most people. Verse 8. Look at verse 8. Let's see verse 8. Verse 8. Matthew chapter 6 and what? Yes, sir. Matthew chapter 6 and verse 8. Look at verse 8. It is where we're going to. I'm going to close and show you something. Notice now. Notice now. It said, Be, be, be not a therefore like unto them. Be, see. So, what makes you like a person is adapting them principally. You see that? Make, what make you like a person that begins to look like them? So even, even though the Bible says um, two shall become one, you know, when they might become one fish, it don't mean say, yeah, some people say, ah, you look like your wife. When you stop tell life. When you stop doing it. In a journey, you can't find When you stop doing All over the world, when you stop doing it. The man don't like him, and the wife don't like him. I see it, they look different, see him. Why are you going to grow more than this? You're going to get to a lie. And I'm lying right till I'm Christian. I tell you, you're going to need to stop it. What allow you to be like a person is to adapt the principle. You see that? Notice, notice, notice listen, listen at the Holy Ghost word we are talking about. Listen to what Jesus said. We're going to make you like you hear them. He said, be therefore not like unto them. See that? Meaning if you do what them do, you become like them. And start to reflect the same personality like them. You can adapt certain personality and of your wife or your husband, but you don't look like them. Amen. The Bible says you divide the people with salvation, right? Yes. A long time about that. We don't still know what we see of Yes. 
If you have a can for your two mother, you go and have it. I wouldn't do it if I didn't be a can of the So when you say, so, so, so you have to understand the context of scripture, the beauty finally means. Where it means. Most of them say, if you divide the word as salvation, you can't see salvation. You know, we can't see kind of person. You see? Really, there are things that God will do in your life. We are going to make people admire you. Yes. Yes. Mm. 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 All right. You see? What class? All right. You see, um, one of the things um, in church of class called my submission. Meaning submitting to people and working together. So for instance, a person says, ah, God give me a call if you do this. I'm God give you a call. If God give you a call if you are in then I'm going to leave the church. See that? If God give you a call in, if you are in that love, he said, God put a ministry for my life. God put a ministry for your life. If you don't have to leave the physical this ministry. Your, your ministry can come incorporated with this. Right. So it can be an extension because this can be a church and the church can have a department for the charity. That's a ministry. Notice, I put it in a simple way. Moses was the head of the church in the wilderness, right? But the ministry God called Joshua at that time. Joshua ministry was to war. So, but he still stayed under Moses. And but he fight. Moses cannot fight because the way Moses is dead, Aaron can't fight because Aaron is a priest. So Aaron never have to leave Israel and leave Moses and make, to get calm for the priest. So many times people do those things. Some of them, mainly some of them first, are people money. God give me a ministry money. So give me ministry money. I want to tell us a ministry, ministry can run in a property and a ruin. I talk to you and I talk to you again. If you divide, if you depend, it's a church money may I get to survive. But I look like that's that, that subright is really funny. Like that. That's standing, but I'm all like that standing. You understand? That's why I say when many people think about it, they think, because let me tell you something. We learn something being right here, so. So whatever people don't mean enough money, and look at the people don't mean look at the money. Because it's a church full. I'm God blessed. Not even me, not even me, me, not even me gas money, but people come here and I'm going to get. I'm a church having a little less people. I'm going to get even more than that. So, yeah, yeah. so people have to understand sometimes at the concept where they have. But when they do that and then do and, and then some of them have some long time against the leader. Man. So right there with them say, God give me a call. And I see that so he can hold me down. Wait, wait, wait. You understand? So, so these people have problem. But they have problem of attitude problems. They have, they have, they have problem. So notice what Jesus said. We go there now. Verse 8. He said, be be there for the life on today. So as I said to you before, um, Adapting people practices make you like them. That's why people say, where do people say, um, you're just like your father, you're just like your mother. They're not referred to you looking like, as somebody really look like your parents. We're not the matter. You're just like your father. I mean, the same thing with your father that you see The same thing with your mother that you see here. It's amazing. You see, um, and you grew up without your father and do things like your father. You see, a, a woman grew up without her mother, a girl grew up without her mother, and do things just like her mother. Because that don't know it in her true spirit. So what makes you become like people is so you adapt certain principles spiritual to yourself. Just like Jesus said, don't be like them. That's why I that's why me about everything with them. Do. They say, if you want to do that, you want to be hypocrite like them. You want to be heathen like them. So make sure tell them what they do. 
I said, don't do like that. Man. Look at it now. Where they know? He ate the last part. He said, for your father knew it. What things he have need of before you ask. In other words, this does not make prayer unnecessary. This does not mean you don't have to pray. Ah, God knows me, so we don't have to pray. But as we see when we walk with the Lord, and tomorrow we just get the and say, Ah, God knows me, so say, No. What this means, it, it's supposed to give you more assurance. You see that? This is supposed to give you an assurance. I understand what I'm saying? It's supposed to give you an assurance. That if God knows for what? Before we ask, we're going to ask and I'll get it. So give an assurance and give a confidence. And it make you feel good. Can you notice know When you have a mother or father or a parent, and you yourself um, as a parent, your child feel good and knows that approach and say, Mommy, we want this, you're able to give them. You understand? Know you yourself feel good when you're able to fulfill the children and needs. So God Himself also feel good. If you know when you come to him, he can fulfill what you need. Let me put it this way. Let me also put it this way. You can mean unto you that some of you, no matter what type of attitude your children come with, to you will give them things. But let me talk to me and the Holy Ghost. If my son comes to me, he should have to me everything I'm telling him now. And I tell him what I'm telling him, and he'll ask us it. But some of you, no matter where your children talk to you, you know, give them say, oh, my sweet this. Yes, yes. We have to damage them. We have to develop the wrong attitude and means that they can go to anybody and everybody to see that And it's going to be embarrassed in their life. Not true. Tell the child, no, you know, it's a, it's a great lesson, you know. Teach you to pick up the satisfied, you know. And may I learn to satisfy with a poison. The mother teach you how to satisfy. The mother teach you how to visit people with things they want and don't cry over it and don't, and don't bad mind them over it. Two. So, but but in, this, in this nowadays, oh man, baby mother and baby father, they not teach a child as an opinion of the road. Ah! Oh, that's Because let me tell you something. Only this very deceptive. 
Eu te ansi pe asta, nu s-o bun. Pe asta, pe asta, pe mine am pe suie și la ea, nu? Deci, da? Eu te ansi pe asta, nu? Luxo, nu e, pe asta, pe omul. E, nu? Merge mai să-l prescrie de genul fel. Right? Ție, eu afli understa. We can deceive people because we want to go to Jamaica. Nobody can dress when it when it time to dress and impress like Jamaica. I have, I have been to different countries. I, I never put it there. And Jamaican then by a black people. There's something about that dressing a black people in an arm. The people who can dress when we see. There's some black people who can dress. dangerous. Black people can dress. I mean, I don't know who is in a Jamaica. I don't know how much. 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 You have to understand something. We can deceive people and then give us up or we have already. But the Bible says, your father knew it. What things you have need of before your heart. So you're supposed to give an assurance, an expectancy, confidence, attitude, confidence, expectancy, and assurance. Say, God, I'm going to When you pray. Once you possess this, you say, all right. So you want to feel they understand and, 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 and know today. Don't adapt the wrong principles. But when you adapt the wrong principles, you have to come like And as I said to you before, you have to understand people. If people want to change them, it seems to me is the must of them are like honesty. Amen. So they want to change it into all they want to see. So today I pray that you have learned something where you can reflect on when you when you go in a your time to pray. You can come back to you. So remember, pastor, so if you have the right attitude, if you have confidence, expectancy, and assurance. And I know the pastor said, you show it from the Bible, so you go back and look back, you go back and look back at it in Matthew chapter 6 and verse 5 to 8 and read it again. You say, yeah. So, sir, what people never say, I saw me born, I saw me born, I saw me live, and I saw me again. As when I'm saying, and that's what happened today. You see that? As when I'm saying, it's my mind, listen. Listen, listen. You. God says something. I told you I find it in the scripture now. Anybody have internet? Yeah, yeah. Type in a Google. I tell you to type in from Google. As he has spoken in my ears, so shall I do it. Write it Google. As, as he have spoken in my ears. So will I go. Let's start with King James Word. I saw in a new term, no, no, no. So we can find. You have to understand. People see like the faith in the moon. You understand what I'm saying? People see the moon faith in the moon. That's the Bible, the life and death in the world. But you know the one, the one who's one given in the other. As he has spoken. Close my heart, my gentleman.